Hey guys, it's Sarah and today we are going to talk about my album that I'm going to get started on here this week. Now, this album is going to be a 12 by 12 album about my Boston and Savannah trips that I took in 2018. And I wanted to do them together because I took them um, almost back to back. One was in September, one was in October. They were both for my birthday. One was with my best friend, one was with my husband but they were both kind of like birthday celebrations for me. So I wanted to have them both together in the same album, like just one big 12 by 12 album. And they were both very special trips. They were also pretty short. They were just, you know, like weekend trips, um, like two nights type thing. So, but I have a lot of pictures, <laughs> of course. All right. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and get started on it, but I wanted to show you kind of where I am in this process and how this is going to go because it's going to be a little bit sporadic. Now, the biggest thing I want you guys to know is I'm not going to be doing this in order. I'm just going to do pages when I feel like doing them and in whatever order I feel like doing them. So I'm not going to, you know, be starting from the very beginning, page one, and then working my way through it and doing it in order. I'm just going to do it whenever, and then I will just put them in the album in the order that I want to do it. So because of that, I will have a final flip through of the album when I'm completely done with it, whenever that will be. So you can kind of see it beginning to end, but my process is going to just be, you know, whatever I feel like making at the time. So, um, first thing is I have all my pictures printed. I actually had to put in a order oops, with Persnickety because um, my at-home printer <laughs> it just doesn't want to work right now. It's great. Um, it's not printing pictures. It's like it's printing them, but the ink is all over the place. The coloring is all off. It's just not doing its job anymore. So we're in the market for a new printer. Haven't done as much research as we probably should be. <laughs> so until then I'm having to either use what I already have printed or if I want to print pictures I have to like order them so I don't know. But Persnickety was awesome and I mean it came so fast. Um, it's a little harder with them to do different sizes so I do have some 3x4s and 4x6s and I have 1x5x7 and that's what I have. Um, but yeah, so it was, it's a little more difficult. Like if I wanted to get a four by four or a three by three or something, it was a little more difficult to do that with this, but I got everything I wanted here. Um, and I have already, um, written out all of the layouts that I want to do and which pictures are going to go there and, you know, all that stuff. So I already kind of have a plan, um, with this so uh yeah but these are all the pictures i have a whole whole lot <laughs> a whole whole lot um and some of them are like this because this was from my friend's phone so it didn't print a full four by six for whatever reason and like it was okay so um i have those quite a bit and then the one five by seven i did was the highlight of our boston trip Oops, which is my husband and I at Hamilton, and that was us in front of the stage. So that's the five by seven. Um, and yeah, so I, but I was really happy with the quality of prints from Persnickety that I got. They're not sponsoring this. I just, I really liked it. So um, probably not the cheapest. Next time I do a order, I'll probably wait until there's like a good sale or something. But I mean, it was fine. I think I paid $30 for all these, like sh including shipping and stuff. And it shipped within like... A day or two like it was insanely fast I thought I was gonna have to like wait a couple weeks but nope okay so my pictures are all printed I have absolutely everything printed for this album that I want to do and um, I have been slowly kind of gathering things in this iris container as I'm going through some of my supplies and I thought this could be fun on the Hamilton page because they're tickets and it's yellow um, this could also be good this could be good, like City of Departure, City of Arrival. You know, we took a flight, my husband and I did. I heard the city. I'm definitely going to do one about the city. So I was, I'm kind of just throwing things in here as I'm going through them and seeing some good stuff. I also have a couple of page kits that are ready to go. I just needed the pictures and now I have them. So I have three in here apparently. Um, I think this one is for a restaurant that we went to in Savannah called The Pink House. Um, this one is for Boston, kind of like a just a downtown type thing. Um, and then, and like actually this could work in there. So I might, let's see. Yep, because it's got the pink, 
got a couple pinks in there, so I'm gonna toss this in here because I think that would go nicely. Uh, and then this one, see I already wrote all these down. Let's see what this one is for. Um, this might be a Boston one as well. Boston wood grain sign. Yep. Okay. So I have a big like wood grain sign that said Boston on it and it was huge. So I took a picture. So I did that for that one. So I have three page kits already to go. Like that's where I'm going to start for sure because those are already done for me. Um, and then all these are things that I'm just, I want to put in the album. This is a napkin from Cheers. <laughs> um, so I do need to also go through these things and, you know, see what I want to put in here and all that stuff. Um, and this is our hotel key from our hotel that we stayed at in Boston and a little um, note card from it. And I, I have a habit of getting uh, business cards from restaurants that we eat at and stuff. So I like to include those if I can. Um, so yeah, pretty cool. Oh, I even have the place mat. Like this was the place mat that was under our food while we were eating. <laughs> and I actually had one that wasn't... Um, dirty. So I folded it up and put it in my purse. Yes, I did. I'm surprised it actually stayed this nice. Um, but I want to get this in the album somehow. I might just put this in a, like a page protector, um, and put it in the album. Is that going to, how, let me see how long this is. It looks longer than a 12 by 12, but let's see. Oh yeah, it is. Um, so I don't know if I would be cutting this down or not. I'd have to only cut it down. Um, let's see, ballpark here, only about two inches. I could cut off an inch from each side there. Um, but it'd be nice to kind of just like put this in right next to the layout about that restaurant because it was awesome. Um, and then I have my playbills here from Hamilton. I actually wanted to see what company we saw. Um, cause I'm not sure what company it was that we saw. I know they have different companies, um, that do the um, the shows, you know. So I was gonna see, but I'm not 100% sure if I'm gonna be able to find it right now, so I'll have to do that later. Um, but it was awesome, like really, really awesome. And um, loved it, loved it, okay. So these are just kind of the, some of the things that I have. Um, these are some bags from um, bookstores that I went to in Savannah. We didn't do any bookstores in um, Boston. We only really had like six hours to walk around Boston before the show and then we left the next day. It was like really, it was a fast, fast um, thing. But yeah, I'm, I'm probably not gonna use all these, but some of these are just so stinking cute. Look at that, it's so cute. Um, but I'm, I'm sure I will not actually. <laughs> the Paula Deen store. Yeah, we ate at Paula Deen's restaurant. Um, the Lady and Sons one. Ugh, it was awesome. Okay. So just some examples of some stuff that we have or some stuff that I collected. And, um, we're going to see what all I can actually get onto the, um, pages and stuff like that. So I just wanted to give you kind of an overview of what I have already and what I've collected. I have a lot of stuff to put in here, obviously. Um, I'm going to go through and get the pictures into my page kits as well, but I'm going to go ahead and get started um, like right now. So my next video, which will be up on Wednesday, I will have um, my first one, which um, I guess if I just want to start from the top, I'll do this one here. So I need to find some thickers. Um, but yeah, so that is what my plans are. And um, I just wanted to kind of share that with you, let you know, but I'm gonna go ahead and do this page right now and then I will have this video up on Wednesday so you guys can see it. And um, I can't guarantee I'm gonna have a video every single week on this project or not, but I am at least getting started. I know I've had a lot of questions of everyone like wondering when I'm gonna get started on this because you saw me take those trips and you know do all that stuff and I've talked about it. Um, so I'm finally getting <laughs> around a year later and I'm not kidding, um, we went to Savannah last September at the end of September and then we went to Boston right after my birthday which is October 7th so like we went in October so literally a year later I'm getting started on this album which is like ridiculous but 
it's okay. Um, so yeah. All right, like I said, I'm gonna go ahead and get started. You'll see the first one coming up here on Wednesday and I will try to work on this as much as I can. I'm gonna keep this on my desk so that it's looking at me in the face all the time. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to let you know what my plans are gonna be. And I will have a playlist for this album as well with um, all the stuff that I'm doing and all that so you guys can see them. And then again, at the end, I'll have a full flip through so you guys can see it beginning to end as well when I get to that point. But all right, I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know if you guys have any questions at all and I will see you again soon. Have a great day. Bye.